and I, a senator from Illinois, a senator from Arkansas and Kansas, and her, we're all protected from the by the Constitution with the right to life. Would you agree with that, Senator from California? Answer that question. I support the Roe versus Wade decision. So, so you would agree that any child that's born has the right to life. It's protected under the Constitution. Once that child I, is born, I, I agree that with the Roe versus Wade decision, and I think what you're doing goes against it and will harm the women of this country, and I will speak to that issue when I get the floor myself. Well, but I, I'd like to ask you, ask you a question. You, you agree that once the child is born, is separated from the mother, that that child is protected by the Constitution and cannot be killed. You agree with that? I would make this statement, that this Constitution, as it currently is, and some of you want to amend it to say that life begins at conception, I think that when you bring your baby home, when your baby is born, and there is no such thing as partial birth, the baby belongs to your family and has all the rights. But I'm not willing to amend the Constitution to say that a fetus is a person, which I know you would, but we'll get into that later. I, I no, would prefer, I, to, well, I would like, prefer I, to adjust. I know my colleague is engaging me in a colloquy on his time, and I appreciate it. I will answer these questions. Well, but I'd like, I, I'd think, I think what my friend is doing by asking me these questions is off point. My friend wants to tell the doctors in this country what to do. My friend from Pennsylvania says they're rogue doctors. The AMA will tell you they no longer support you. The American nurses don't support you. The obstetricians and gynecologists don't support you. So my friend can, can ask reclaim, me my philosophy all day. If I can reclaim on my, my time, own time, I'll talk about it. I can reclaim my time. First off, uh, the AMA uh, still believes this is bad medicine. They do not support the criminal penalties provision in this bill, but they still believe, I think you know that to be the case, that this procedure is not medically necessary, and they stand by that statement. I would ask the senator from California, again, you believe that once that you said, well, once the baby comes home, obviously you don't mean that they have to take the baby out of the hospital for it to be protected by the Constitution. Once the baby is separated from the mother, you would agree, completely separated from the mother, you would agree that that baby is entitled to constitutional protection. I'll, I'll tell you why I don't want to engage in this. You did this same conversation with a colleague of mine, and I never saw such a twisting of his remarks. Well, I'm not clear, talking then. about... Let's I, be clear. I'm going to be very clear when I get the floor. What you are trying to do is to take away the rights of women and their families and their no, doctors if I can reclaim my to time, have a procedure. Do, and now you're trying to, to turn California, the question in when does floor. life begin? I'll President, talk about that on my own time. Mr. President, what I'm trying to do is to get the an answer. From Pennsylvania has what I'm the trying time. to do is get an answer from the senator from California as, as to where you would draw the line. Because, that's, because that really is the important part of this debate. The senator from Pennsylvania I will repeat, for a question. I will repeat, since the senator has asked Pennsylvania me... Pennsylvania has the time. Since the I, senator has asked me a question, I told you very... I'm answering the question that I've been posed by the senator. And the answer to the question is, I stand by Roe v. Wade. I stand by it, and I hope we have a chance to vote on it. It's very clear, Roe v. Wade. That's what I stand by. Are you suggesting My Roe v. Wade covered the cover the issue of, 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 of the baby in the process of being born? I'm saying what Roe v. Wade says is that in the early stages of a pregnancy, a woman has the right to choose. In the later stages, the states have the right, yes, to come in and restrict. I support those restrictions as long as two things happen. They respect the life of the mother and the health of the mother. I understand and that. that's where I stand. And no matter how you try to twist it, that's where I stand. I would say to the senator from California, I'm not twisting anything. I'm, I'm simply asking a very straightforward well, question. I'll there's no, there's, there's no hidden, I'll answer hidden it again. question here. The, the I'll question answer it is again. that once the baby is born, is completely separated from the mother, you will support that that baby has, in fact, the right to life and cannot be killed. You accept that, right? I don't believe in killing any human being. That is absolutely correct, and nor do you, I'm sure. So you would accept the fact that once the baby is separated from the mother, that baby cannot be killed? I support the right, and I will repeat this again, because I saw you ask the same question to another senator. All the person has to do is give me a straight answer. And, and what do you define separation? 
Define separation. Well, let's you define answer that, that question. Okay, well, that, you let's define say that the baby is completely separated. In other words, no part of the baby is inside of the mother. I mean, the baby has been birthed and is now in its mother's arms. Well, that baby is I don't know if it's necessarily being. in the mother's arms, but it's, well, let's say it in the obstetrician's hands. It takes a minute to do I had two babies. And within We've seconds had six. of their birth, so well, I, I, well, you I, didn't have any. Your wife had. Well, my wife, wife and I had babies together. That's your the wife gave birth. I gave birth, and I can tell you, I know when the baby was born. Good. And I can All tell I'm you, all I'm asking you is, I once the baby, the baby leaves the mother's birth canal and is 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 through through the vaginal orifice and is in the hands of the obstetrician, you would agree that then you cannot abort that you cannot kill. I the baby. would say when the baby is born. The baby is born and would then have every right okay. of every other human being living in this country. And I don't know why this would even be a question. Well, I, well be because, because we're talking about a, a situation here where the baby is almost born. And so I would ask the question of the senator from California. If the baby was born except for the baby's foot, if the baby's foot was inside the mother but the rest of the baby was outside, could that baby be killed? The baby is born when the baby is born. That's I'm the answer to, to the this, question. I'm asking you to I don't think for me anyone what that but is. the senator from Pennsylvania has a, a question with it. I've never been troubled by this question. The baby, you give birth to a baby, the baby is there and it is born. So if that's the my answer so to the question. So if the, well, but what we're talking about here with partial birth is the senator I would from California say that knows the baby is, is the baby born in when the process the baby of being born. And yet there's the there's process very small of being part born. of the baby inside of well, the mother. This is why this conversation makes no sense. Because to me, it's obvious when a baby is born. To you, it isn't obvious. Well, uh, maybe you can make it obvious to me. So, if, so what you're su suggesting is if the baby's foot is still inside of the mother, that that baby could then still be killed. No, I'm not suggesting that well, I'm in any way. I'm absolutely not suggesting that. You asked me a question. Well, in I'm essence, I'm when the again. baby is can born, can you answer that I will question? answer the question when the baby is born. The baby is born when the baby is outside the mother's body. The baby is born. So, so, and I'm not, I'm not going to put words in your mouth. But again, what you're suggesting then is that if, if the baby's toe is inside of the mother, you could kill, you, you can in fact kill that baby. Absolutely not. Okay. So, if the baby's toe is in, you can't kill the baby. How about if the baby's foot is in? You're the one who's making these statements. I'm asking I'm you. Gonna, I'm, we're trying I'm to not, draw a line. Here. I'm not answering what you are these questions. Is that I'm the not baby's answering these questions. inside the mother, you can kill the baby. My friend is losing his temper. Let me say to my friend once again, and he's laughing and I'm getting laughing. very, very red in the face. Let me tell you, this woman is not laughing right now because if your law was the law of the land, she might either be dead or infertile. So if the senator wants to laugh about this, he can laugh all You're he wants. You're claiming my time, Mr. President. All I would suggest is I was, I was not laughing about the discussion. It's a very serious discussion. I was, uh, I was smiling at your characterization of my demeanor. Uh, I have not lost my temper. I, I, uh, I think I'm, frankly, very composed at this point. But what I, I would say, and the senator's walking away, is that the senator said that, and again, the baby is born when the baby is born. I said, well, if the, if the, if the foot is still inside the, uh, the mother, she says, well, no, you can't kill the baby. Well, at what point, if the foot's inside the mother, you can't, but if the head is the only thing inside, you can. And so here's... Here's the line. See, this is where it gets a little funny. Parliamentary inquiry, so, Mr. President. Let the record show that I did not say what the senator from Pennsylvania said that I did. Thank you. Um, Mr. President, I, I, I hate to do this, but could, could we have the clerk read back what the senator from California said with respect to that question? understand the that that will take some time for us to do that and, and I will I'll be happy I would say to my friend it's I'm not interested I know what I said I am saying your character characterization of what I said is incorrect I didn't talk about the head or the foot that was what my colleague talked about and I don't appreciate it being misquoted on the floor over a subject that involves the health and life of the women of this country and the children of this country and the families of this country. It also involves, and that's the point that I think the senator from California is missing, it also involves when in the process, and that's why people are on both sides of the abortion issue support this bill, 
because it also involves what is infanticide and what is not. And, and, and a lot of people who agree with you on the issue of abortion say this is too close to infanticide. This is a baby that's outside of the mother. And when, and again, I won't put words in the senator's mouth, but what I heard, and again, I'm willing to have that corrected by the record, and the senator can correct me right now. When I heard her say that if the foot is inside the mother, no, you cannot kill the baby, but when the head is, you can, that is a pretty slippery slope. Well, if I say to my friend, what I said was, I wasn't answering those questions. That the, what the senator was trying to do is debate me on his terms of how he sees this issue. We have a situation where if this is outlawed, this procedure is outlawed, it will hurt the women and the families of this country. Now, my friend can disagree with that, but I never got into the issue of what is someone, when is someone born. I said to you, I'm very clear on that, and I understand that completely. But it was my friend who kept on asking these questions, which to me don't make any sense. I can reclaim the issue my here is an emergency procedure that my friend from Pennsylvania wants to make illegal, and it will hurt the women, and it will hurt the families of this country.